All right. Hello, boys and girls. Today we're going to be learning about biographies and autobiographies. We're going to be talking all about the similarities and comparisons between the two. What is a biography? A biography is an informational text about a real person. It is not written by the subject or the author, and it is not about the subject or the author. It's always written in third person. Words that you'll see are he, she, they, and names. What is an autobiography? An autobiography is an informational text about a real person that is written by the subject and author and is about the subject and author themselves. It is always written in first person. Some examples of first person buzzwords that you will see as you're reading are me, my, and I. How is a biography different from an autobiography? A biography is not written by the subject of the novel. On the other hand, an autobiography is written by the subject of the novel. How are biographies and autobiographies similar? Both biographies and autobiographies are considered nonfiction texts, part of the nonfiction genre, as they have real, accurate information in them, not made up scenarios or stories, it's nothing about fantasy or fiction, it's nonfiction. Both bi biographies and autobiographies are also often written in chronological order and include nonfiction text features, which we will talk about later. Both biographies and autobiographies are written about people who have made an impact or important contribution to society. Here are some examples of biographies. If we look at these different examples, notice who the author is. Remember, biographies are written by other people. So we have LeBron James, The Making of an MVP. It's by two other people besides LeBron James. The most common examples of biographies are who was books that you can see here. Examples of autobiographies. Let's look at the examples here and look at the authors. Barack Obama, Dreams of My Father. It's written by Barack Obama. Hard Choices by Hillary Clinton. It's an autobiography about her life. So let's review what we talked about. Autobiographies versus bi biographies. Both autobiographies and biographies have real facts and information. They are true stories. They have nonfiction text features which can, be, which can be used to better understand the story. They have important events, people, and settings. They include timelines and chronological order. And they're written about people who have made contributions to society. The biggest difference between the two is that an autobiography is written about the author and subject themselves and about their lives. A biography, on the other hand, is not written about the subject or the author, and the story is not about that subject or the author. Now that you are experts on similarities and differences between bi biographies and autobiographies, you will complete a Kahoot on them. Remember, Kahoot is an online quiz. It's interactive. To access this assignment, go to my website and find the link called Biography vs. Autobiography Kahoot link and get started.